Farewell to one of our greats, Stan Lee. Let's take a moment of silence to remember him. Thank you for all the characters that you created and influenced. You will forever be remembered. Thank you for all the amazing cameos. Excelsior! You have been a great inspiration. Rest in peace, Stanley. And now to remember him, let's check out all of his cameos. Answer the question! David, you must answer the question! Excuse me, I'm looking for some guy named Stan Lee. What? Spider-Man? Uh, Pam, hold my calls for a while. I, I think I've finally gone crazy. You know, Spidey, I've always wanted to experience real web-slinging. And I've always wanted to be appreciated as a real hero. It seems you've made me into one. Thanks. Hey. You, um, looking at that couple inside? Actually, I was just looking at this, uh, little pink number over here. Oh, yeah, that's kind of nice. They look happy, don't they? You know, it reminds me of an issue of Spider-Man I did when Peter Parker and Gwen Stacy went lingerie shopping. Of course, the Green Goblin showed up, and he pumpkin-bombed the hell out of the place. But aside from that, it, it's pretty much the same thing. Oh, my God. Holy shit! Aren't you? Oh, Stanley. Hi. Welcome back to the Baxter, Dr. Richards. I've got the usual for you. Good to have you back, sir. Thanks, Willie. You know, I guess one person can make a difference. Enough said. Uh, invitation, sir. Um, I should be on that list. Name? Stanley. Yeah, uh, nice try, buddy. Nice no, no, try. really, I'm nice Stanley. Yeah. Hey, Tony. You remember me? Sure don't. Look great, half. For gamma sickness, Milwaukee. A man drank one of those Garana sodas. Guess it had a little more kick than he was looking for. Wow. Where was it bottled? Puerto Verde. Larry. Hey, the Oracle of Oracle. What a pleasure. Nice to see you. King. Larry! Oh. This is 
probably nothing. <gasps> Are your pulses pounding? Can you feel its eyes upon you? The dweller in the dark is watching. Relax, uh, Harry. It's just Stan. And all the other worlds would just pass us by. It's beautiful. It's simple. Any questions? Yeah, can I have my shoe back? All Mom ever wanted was your love. To be with you on our two-story Victorian home in the Cotswolds. But could you even give her a moment? What with your banking job requiring you to travel to the States from Tuesday to Saturday every other week? No! I'm terribly sorry about your loss, dear. As for you, now is your chance to do better. Why don't you see that you take it? Thank you, sir. Let's go. Wear that? No. If you're gonna fight a war, you gotta wear a uniform. I am so fired. Ooh, it's not cool to get help. Walk by yourself, you little gargoyle. Look at Mr. Smiles over here. You like gorgeous. Where's your wife, old man? What a class A prefer. <laughs> Fred. Son. Dad. I wear them front. I wear them back. I, I go, go inside, inside out. out. Then, then I go, I go front, front and, and back. back. Dad! Alexis Ortiz. See this? This was aged for a thousand years. The barrels built from the wreck of Brunhill's fleet is not meant for mortal men. Neither was Omaha Beach, Blondie. Stop trying to scare us. Come on. All right. Egg shell shear. Hey. Could I borrow the sports section? Thank you. I'm fine, right? The bartenders are all like, yeah, crazy stupid fine. Coming on to our stage right now. Give it up for chastity. Uh, you okay? Are you Tony Stank? Yes, this is this is Tony Stank. Hilarious. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Yeah. Wow, nice suit. Zip it, Stanley. Oh man. Anyway, before I was so rudely interrupted, at that time I was a Federal Express man. Hey fellas. Hey, wait, where are you going? Hey, you were supposed to be my lift home. How will I get out of here? Hey. Ah, oh, gee, I've got so many more stories to tell. Ah, oh, guys. Oh, gee. Hey, stop. 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 Every day with these stop. damn alarms. Shut it off. Don't make me come down there, you punk. Hey, Gary. How you doing? Marjorie, how are you? How's your mother? Now, don't you move. My hands aren't as steady as they used to be. By Odin's beard, you shall not cut my hair, lest you feel the wrath of the mighty Thor. <laughs> Please, kind sir, do not cut my hair. <laughs> no! No! 
They're the greatest stories ever told. Heroes show us we don't need to be perfect to do what's right. It's not about living without fear, but facing injustice. It's not about being powerful, but finding your calling when you least expect it. They show us it's okay to be vulnerable. No matter how tough you are. Because even though they're heroes, they're still human. I think whatever you do, you should do what you most want to do and what you're best at. Too many people don't really do what their heart's desire is, but they try to do something else because they think, well, it'll be easy to get a job or to make money. And if that happens, then when you're doing it, you feel like you're working. But if you do what you really want to do, you feel like you're playing. It's easier for you to do. This place is amazing, yo. They're really making movies about every superhero. And it's time they make one about me. Come on, Kate Wilson's soundstage must be around here somewhere. Hey, I'm Stan Lee, doing my subtle cameo. Excuse me, Mr. Stan. This is a DC movie? Oh, gee, I gotta get out of here. Hey, Stan Lee! I'm back. I don't care if it's a DC movie. I love cameos. Not now, Stan Lee! Excelsior!